Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Good morning, my dear friends in Christ. We begin this Sunday reflection in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Today is the 17th Sunday in ordinary time, ye be. We thank God for being alive in the land of the living. Thank you, Jesus. Our Bible reading today is taken from the Gospel of John, chapter 6, from verse 1 to 15. And our topic is, Jesus fed multitudes with few loaves of bread and fish. Our Lord Jesus Christ fed the multitudes with few loaves of bread and fishes. Large crowds of people always follow our master, the Lord Jesus Christ. The more he preaches to them and heals their diseases, the more they run to him anywhere he went. In our passage of today, our Lord Jesus Christ saw the multitudes of people and moved with compassion. He wanted to feed them, but there was no food and not enough money to buy bread to feed that large crowd of about 5,000 men without counting women and children. But we thank God that he cannot fail and he is not helpless like human beings. All that was available was only five loaves of bread and two fish, which a good mother possibly packed for her little son. The master took the boy's lunch back and prayed. What happened after the prayer? was the miracle of the feeding of the multitudes. Hallelujah. Amen. Brothers and sisters in Christ, our God is not limited. Hear me again. Our God is not limited. He can turn small to become big. He can make the weak to be strong. He can turn anything that is ordinary to extraordinary. Thank you, Jesus. Our God, the Master, the King of Kings, saves and satisfies. Did you hear that? I said Jesus saves and Jesus satisfies. Our Lord Jesus Christ, the Lord saves and he satisfies. He is our Savior. He is our satisfier. On that occasion, he ministered to both the spiritual and physical needs of the people. What he did in the days of the early disciples, he is still doing them today. And he will continue to do it for you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. All you need is to come to him, learn of him, and follow him. Obey his instructions. On that day, he gave instructions to his disciples. They followed the instructions and the miracle happened what are you looking for child of god everything that concerns life and godliness is available in the lord jesus christ come to him for salvation come to him for satisfaction of your needs the lord will satisfy you and the lord will save you you that is hearing this message in the name of jesus christ amen May we experience the fullness of God's salvation and provision for our needs through Christ our Lord. Amen. God feeds the multitude. Remember, that is the topic. And as you pray, as you come to him, as you come to him closer and closer, he will feed you. He will save you. He will satisfy you. May the Lord give us understanding through Christ our Lord. Amen. Happy Sunday and have a fruitful week ahead. You are highly blessed. Amen. Thank you, Jesus.